Hey, what's going on? It's Tybreaker back on our video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make cinematics. So I'm going to be doing this in Modern Warfare, but you can do this in any game you want. And if you're on console, make sure you're using a capture card or it's not going to look that good. So I have a um, custom game mode already set up for cinematics, but I'll show you all the settings so you can copy them down. I'll just go through each one slowly. So in this tutorial, I'm also going to be showing you how to make the cinematic for 3D text, how to find a good spot to put the 3D text, but the 3D text will be next tutorial. I also forgot to mention that you need to have one bot. Just one bot doesn't matter, enemy or friendly. Doesn't matter difficulty, just have one bot in. So I'm going to make two cinematics, one for 3D text and one right after 3D text. So to find a good spot for 3D text, you might want to find somewhere with a flat surface so you can motion track it. So you can either go from a wall, away from a wall, it's on the ground. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it the text floating in the air. It's like right here would be fine. Here would be good. Start recording. And then just kinda, and go really slowly when you make cinematics and then you just speed them up in After Effects. Just go really slowly. So that's good for the first one. Do you try to make another one right after that? I'm not, this one isn't gonna have 3D text, so it's not gonna matter. So I'm just gonna have it going kind of like. Also, it takes me a while to find good cinematics. I often redo cinematics so they don't look good, and I usually record more than I need to just so I have enough to pick from. And also, don't make like sudden jerky movements like this. Like, just make it all really one smooth motion. So now I'm gonna make it on the other map that I have and I'll see you in After Effects. So now you've recorded your cinematics, you cut them up so it's only the cinematic and not the extra part. So I just cut them up in Premiere Pro, exported them so it's just this. You wanna um, right click on it, time, enable time remapping, and now we're gonna shorten it. So we're gonna make it kind of like right. Oh, I forgot one thing for another tutorial, for another episode for the series. I'm gonna do that one transition that I did in that my Mama Show Love montage. So I'll show you guys how to do that in another tutorial. So I'm just gonna overlap this for now. So to shorten it, what you wanna do is grab the first keyframe and just move it. Let's move it somewhere right over here. We're not shortening, we're um, speeding it up. Just like that. So now, same thing with these clips. You want to make a keyframe right on the beat. And you also want to mute the, mute the clip. So don't put too many keyframes on the Cinemax, or it's just going to look too choppy, kind of. So again, highlight all of them, right click, keyframe assistant, easy ease. And then same thing, just adjust them however you like. Don't make them too steep or too shallow. Let's kind of Let's see how this looks. Okay, so I like that. So now what you want to do is have the clip selected, press R on your keyboard, and now we're going to rotate it. So what I normally do is I usually make it either 8 degrees or negative 8 degrees. So for the first one, I'm probably going to make it 8 degrees. So it's rotated like this and press the stopwatch right here. And then what you want to do is you want to make the cinematic a little bit bigger so it covers more of the screen. And then later on we're going to add black bars so you can't really see it. You want to go to the end of the cinematic. If you did 8 degrees in the beginning, you want to do negative 8 on the, at the end. And if you did negative 8 in the beginning, you want to do 8 in the end. So it's kind of just rotated like this. So looks good, so I'm going to do the same thing with the other cinematic. Okay, so that's it for this tutorial. 
and next tutorial is gonna be on 3D text. So I'll see you in that tutorial.